You didn't know you were going to have a birthday? I didn't. <laughs> I, I didn't know. She told me that she was just going to have two people, just her and her husband, for lunch today and bring me some fried chicken. And that's what I thought she was doing, and I thought that's all it was going to be. And now look what's happened. I'm going to turn eight. So this is a very big deal, a very big event. I wanted to have something that she would always remember. It had to be creative, and it had to be outside the box. Well, I'm just amazed and surprised. I've never been through anything like this, but it's been wonderful to see everybody, and I just love my daughter for doing it. I, I told her I would have washed my hair and curled it better, <laughs> but I had no idea. I had no idea. Happy birthday to you. Thank you. My mother has the biggest sweet tooth that it's known to mankind. So instead of purchasing a lot of gifts, because at 80 years old you have just about everything, I told everybody to just bring one candy bar with a saying. However, you see people came out in droves and they've been very creative and they've made posters and they brought candy and some people did bring flowers, but that was the whole thing was just to bring candy because she's such a sweet person. <laughs> you are at Almond Joy that Snickers or that satisfies. Don't be a cow's tail. Yeah. <laughs> Jack. <laughs> I can't touch it, but I love you. <laughs>